still waiting on corn to harvest some. So uh, I got a free Saturday here. So we're gonna load one of my favorites and uh, go to the uh, old Settlers Day uh, tractor show, the way they were tractor show in Smith Center, Kansas this weekend. We're gonna load up my 66-1206 standard. Um, I don't know how many hours are on it. I found it. I found it in uh, Ulysses, Kansas. It's been sitting for a long, long time. Uh, it's all original like you see it. I had to put a turbo on it. Um, it's got a TA dual remote, 24 and a half, 32 rubber, and it is weighted to the gills. Um, I think with me on it, it comes across the scales at like 14,900 pounds, if I remember correctly. It's a heavy old girl, but it is fun. I've used it to drill some oats and sedan grass and stuff like that and i never ever get tired of running this thing before we get it loaded here on the trailer and uh, chained down and head to smith center Well, it doesn't get much easier than that. Throw two chains, she's ready to rock and roll. Tires I checked earlier, every, all the wheel bearings are full of oil. We're pretty much ready to rock and roll here. So we'll get over to Smith Center, I guess. It's a big old thing. It's about as heavy as I like to be behind a pickup, but you gotta do what you gotta do.
Smith Center this year. Um, I loaded up my 1206. I'm headed home now. So can't wait till next year. Guess uh, we had three inches of rain two days ago, so that's going to delay harvest a little bit. But uh, this week, hopefully, get out the wheat drill and uh, give it a once over. And uh, we're going to work a little ground and then drill about 160 acres of wheat sometime soon, along with getting corn harvest rolling. So everybody have a great day. Please like, follow, share, subscribe, whatever. And, uh, you know, go have some fun and go drag a project out of the weeds.